the curly hair. Yeah. Yeah. Okay? Let's go. know then you know I can't get my day started without a coffee um, but I'm gonna be taking you guys along while I do all my travel maintenance lashes nails hair everything okay so right now I'm on my way to go get my lashes and I'm just waiting on my uber so yeah once I get in my uber and get to her house I'll pick the camera back up So I did them slightly different than I did the last time. The last time I had spikes. I'm definitely gonna insert videos and pictures of the last time I got them done. But I got spikes on bottom. This time I did it without the spikes. Kept the bottom, but I did the bottom extra full, which I'm obsessed with. Okay, obsessed. But love it, love it, love it. Definitely don't want like all my sets looking the same. So I just switched it up just a little bit. But so now all that's left is to get my nails done, my toes done, um, and do my hair. I really wanted to do bone knockers at first, but then I'm just like, mm, no, not really. I'm feeling curly hair, and then my man is feeling curly hair too, so guess what we're gonna do? Curly hair, yeah. So I went ahead and I got me a pedicure French tip and a full set French tip but I didn't even finish recording because I was so unsatisfied with the service so I just skipped that whole clip. Okay guys so it's a few days later um I went to the mall today got me some makeup stuff and I also went to Spencer's so right now I just laid all of my products out of my bed with a few bags and i have some stuff that i want to like try on while i pack so you guys are only going to be seeing like a few selective items of what i'm taking on this trip with me and then the rest you just have to wait like for my next vlog to see what's the fit really given once like i put everything together so hey yeah i'm actually very very excited to do this video because i haven't recorded anything for you guys in a while so it feels good to like really get back to it so yeah so i'm not gonna do my hair until after um this video simply because i don't feel like um i don't know i just don't want to do it now so i'll be doing my my blah, 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 blah. so i believe i gave you guys a spill on the hair i just put my hair in like some cornrows um, obviously, I'm going to put my wig on over this. I'm going to be reinstalling my curly unit. So, I washed her a little bit earlier. So, I just have her drying. I'm going to install her towards the end of the video because I really wanted to get the packing out of the way. Simply because I leave tomorrow. And your girl been working back to back, back to back, no days off. So, I'm not going to do it. So let's get to this video. I'm actually really excited simply because I haven't like uploaded anything in a while. So this is probably going to be like my first official video back. So I really do hope you guys enjoy this type of video. Bring you guys a little bit more into my personal space. Um, so yeah. So a lot of my this. stuff are from Fashion Nova. You my items are from Sheen. Um, so for the most part, I have some of my stuff in my suitcase that I just dumped, um, as they came. And then the rest, I just have it in this bag. I also think that I'm going to like use this as a beach bag. I got this from my job. 
nothing special but i really do like it it's very like metallic beach vibes so i'm gonna throw this in my suitcase because i do want to have like a little picnic on vacation so yeah let's go through this real quick so i have a few sunglasses in here that i'm just gonna throw Maybe I shouldn't have done that. So, definitely shouldn't have done that because I broke my sunglasses. And I really like that. But, so I have a few things that I'm not going to show you guys. And a few things that I can't show you guys. If that makes sense. So... For instance, I have this skirt right here. I'm pretty sure you guys saw it like trending already on social media. I don't want to show you guys it yet because I have a vision for it, but I don't want to like spoil it. So if you want to see how the look comes out, just stay tuned for my other videos or just tune in on my Instagram. Um, now this can't show y'all. Um, I have a few swimsuits that I'm not going to be trying on is mainly just going to be like my clothes. Now with the swimwear, I can definitely insert pictures of what I order. And then obviously you guys can like tune into the videos to see me in my swimwear, but I don't know if I want to be trying on. Okay, so this is dress number one. Um, I switched it around a little bit. I'm not quite sure. I got to look back at the picture, I believe the thicker piece that i'm currently tying around my neck i believe that's supposed to be tied around my, my waist area but for like better security i prefer to tie it this way because i know that i can like you know be free and still feel secure and like the boot area because tying it the opposite way wasn't for me and I really do like this dress because of the back. I adjusted my lights, so hopefully this is better. Um, but yeah, like I said, better hope, like, you know, more secure up here, tied like this. Love the fact that it shows my entire back because I love showing my back out. Um, very, very loose. It stops pretty you know short and when I'm ready to like throw it back he can catch it okay so love it Ooh. another dress now I really really do love this color on me and I think I'm more into like color this year I'm more on like the neutral side I love to wear a whole lot of nudes and a whole lot of whites and black um so the colors are definitely different for me once again a little back action you know real real cute love it really really do love it so yeah okay since we're talking about like neutral and back out i ordered this piece right here um super super cute super super cute but i can't try it because as you guys can see you can see my current outfit under this dress so that's why i'm not gonna try it on but um if i happen to wear it on my trip you guys will you guys will be seeing it but as of right now it's a no for the trying on like you know so there's a lot more to go So before I really get to like the nitty gritty of packing, I like to put everything, well not everything, but like my skincare, makeup product, hair products, I like to have those in pouches. For one, just so nothing spills on my clothes. And for two, it helps me keep my um suitcase a little bit organized. So in this very big one right here, I'm going to be putting my makeup in here because that's usually what I use. So it's pretty stained up on the inside from like foundation and stuff like that. 
So first thing first, I'm going to take my Juvia's Place um, palette. I like to use this little brown shade right here as my nose contour shade. Also, I like to take that up into my crease for like a nice bronzy look. And of course, I'm going to take my Black Radiant um, True Complexion palette. And I like to take stuff that I know I'm not going to care if it gets damaged. So like all like my expensive stuff is what I'm most prone to leave at home. I might take a few but not everything so you guys will see what i mean by that where it's just like i'll take a few like pricey stuff and then a few inexpensive stuff so i have this black radiant blush because i really do love the way it complements my skin my setting powder um i have my Too faced born this way concealer dependent i have a few concealer just because i know every day i'm not gonna want my makeup to be like the same Sometimes I might want a brighter on the eyes. Sometimes I may not. So I have my Born This Way Too Faced Concealer. I have a few of my e.l.f. concealers. And then I have a few of my Juvia's Place concealers. So I'm just going to throw all of these concealers in here. Just because I like to have options. I don't like to like... And I have a few LA Girl Pro Concealer. Um, the Fond and another light one then obviously you need this it's a must and if you guys ever tried the milk primer the elf primer is the exact same thing just way cheaper it does the exact same thing the consistency on your hand and your skin like the longevity of it it's the same as the milk so you're better off getting the um the elf now they have two different ones they have the one in the green tube the one in the pink tube i absolutely love both of them it's just that my green one is basically finished so i'm just gonna walk with the pink one just so i have more so i can use as much as i want to um obviously i'm gonna pack my nala lux of course um hand mirror it just seems like every time i try to be great and make a video there's always noise every single time never never fails so foundation time so i'm gonna be using two different foundation i'm gonna take my um charlotte tilbury foundation and then i'm gonna take one of my juvia's place foundation um can't compare these two together because they do not compare i love charlotte i will live for charlotte i will continue to spend my money on her same as juvia's place um sephora alta high-end drugstore you know that's the same thing just different consistency one is a stick and one is a liquid one would give me more of a natural makeup look and one would give me more of like a full coverage bronze it girl look and i'm definitely gonna need that okay i'm coming with all the looks just so you know you heard, you heard it here before so next is my setting spray elf amazing but I feel like I'm going to need something a little bit more like long lasting. So I definitely went and I got me some Morphe today. Now I got two different Morphe. I got this one also. Um, If you guys are used to like watching my um makeup tutorials and stuff like that. I always use the Morphe Continuous Setting Spray. Either the black can or the white can. Now they were out of the white. Well that's what the girl said. They was out of the white. Um. So this one is like a coconut fragrance one. I'm not going to walk with this one because I don't need it. Um, so I'm going to walk with this one. This is a mini continuous prep and set mist. I haven't even sprayed it. Like, I can't even be mad because I should have opened it at the store. But why should I need to open it at the store? Like, it has no nozzle. Like, what the hell? All right, that's... I guess I'm just going to have to do this. Like, that just really blew me. Like...
Now I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm gonna be packing my lip combos. Um, luxury lashes, of course, gotta rep at all time. So first, I'm gonna go ahead with three of my Nala Lux lip gloss. I'm actually just gonna go with two. I'm gonna go with my favorite two, and also my Nala Lux lip pencil. I'm gonna throw that in the bag. Then I'm just going to throw in my regular lip pencil and a deep brown My Sephora liquid lipstick. This is my Elf Fortune Cookie, my Anastasio liquid lip. This is just a Elf um, liquid lip. And I got this Tarte um, Juicy Lip from Ulta. Let me see what it's getting. I guess I don't know okay and last but not least I'm gonna go ahead and just throw in a few eyebrow pencil I also toss in a few spoolies for my eyelashes then I'm just gonna move on to packaging up my jewelry sunglasses um and then I'm gonna do everything else honestly I'm kind of pissed because I'm trying to record in their BMI room okay guys so this is where i decided to just switch over to voice over um because the noise was just getting a little bit too much for me it just seems like everyone decided to visit my house today which was a bit annoying for me simply because i like to be in a very quiet area when i'm recording um just so you guys can have the best video quality as possible but that wasn't the case so i just finished up this video with a voiceover really really do hope you guys enjoyed this video um and yeah i'll see you guys in the next one Mwah.